This is Dr. Paul Juris of Solo3 and the PGA Kinematics Lab. When it comes to our clients getting results, one of our favorite devices is the Cybex Arc Cross Trainer. We prefer the Arc because its design, ease of use, and variety of training stimuli make it a must-have in any performance environment. We've chosen the Arc Trainer for its outstanding design features. For example, one of the most important factors in getting results is the proper mechanical loading of the joints. Let's examine how the joints are loaded while using the total body arc. As illustrated, the red diagonal line shows the line of force coming off the pedal at the start of the downward motion. The two yellow lines indicate the distance from the line of force to the hip and knee joint centers and are key determinants in the amount of torque placed on those joints throughout the movement. First we'll examine the knee. As shown in the image, the line of force is positioned behind the knee, pushing it into flexion. This is referred to as a flexor torque. The amount of torque acting on the knee is the product of the magnitude of the line of force and its distance from the knee joint center. In response, the performer must use her knee extensors in order to move the pedals, therefore making this an excellent movement for knee extension capability. Next, let's examine the hip. Notice how the line of force falls in front of the hip joint, which, like the knee, when applied at a distance to the joint center, creates a flexor torque, pushing the hip into flexion. In response, the hip extensors must engage in order to create enough force through the hip to set the machine into motion. As with the knee, this is an excellent means of strengthening the hip extensors and developing functional capability. The arc really does challenge the hip and knee, but at the same time protects those joints against undue stress. The red arrow in the illustration above points to the horizontal force component created during the downward movement. This force is responsible for the shear stress exerted at the knee. But because the horizontal component is relatively small in the arc, there are very low shear stresses acting on the knee, even when the knee exerts high levels of force. Because of its high workloads and low stress, the Cybex Arc Trainer really gets results.